wish I had a bow to call mine. A bow. They're calling it. They're calling them bows. That's cute. Are those crabs? Are those crabs? They look like crabs. Okay. Megalo crab. I know we're not alone. Nice. And it heals when I level up. That's that's good to know also. This is very interesting. Uh, diamond toys. Okay, let's try it. Is the back vulnerable at all? Damantite? No, no, no Damantite, I guess. Is that not a thing here? Challenging fight, for sure. Of the megalo crab around here. Yeah. 
Garuda! That. Whew. That was great. Sorry, turtle. I'm sorry, turtle. Oh, am I gonna? Is that a rainbow chocobo? Is that a thing? Very well. If it was, I didn't know about it. Wake, wait. Okay. Yeah, let's check this place out first. That's enough. Yeah, I gotta improve this 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 move the uh, movement skill. Abilities should I should be able to do these abilities with every element. For reason for some reason I'm not. Oh, there is something here. Hmm. Goblin coin. What the fuck is goblin coin? Okay, cool. Hi, brown chocobo? things I, want, I would like to check out. Let's see if I don't forget any of them. Bluebird. What the fuck is a bluebird? Great. Uh, you're not really giving me unique materials, which is what I expected I would get, like chocobo feathers or something. But no, that's not really what I'm getting. Oh, I, I may have used the potion and I did mean to. Oh, it only... Oh, okay, I, I get what the healing does here. Okay. Cool. Hmm, 
and there's a bridge there. That's it. I don't know how I did that, but sure. Well, what happens with Faraga? How do I use Faraga? Come on, man. It took me a while to get there. Could have just waited a bit. So, one, another one of those. Which is fine. It's, it's just fine. Ten bloody hides. easier to dodge now. Great fight. Don't really have a lot to say about that. And can I get my magic to do a little more damage? Because it's it's an amazing resource. That's it. Okay. Got it. I think I explored most of this. This bridge is not working. That's fine. I knew that. And I can cross this bridge. The Abbey. Yes, yet. What darkness awaits us within, I wonder. Arachne. Let's go and see. Nice. Good fight.
there's still, there's still these birds, and I haven't fought them yet. I fought similar birds. Almost made it to, to 500, which is what I wanted. Come on, dude. Ah, there is a, a little fight before I get there. Noise. Uh, before I go into the abbey, okay. What's this going to be about? Good day to you. Hi. I'm afraid the Abbey is not open for public prayer. May Grieger go with you? We came to offer a donation. From Martha. Are you okay? I see. I then still don't know what, the, what, what people are carrying. Me. This is maybe in the lore. I haven't checked that out in a while. I... I don't want to die. Please, Father. Are these people sick, then? Come in for the pain. I beg you. The light... It fades. I don't want to die alone. It's all right. I'm here. It's not Who all right, these though. People? Martha's bearers. She entrusted them to my care that I might ease their suffering. To the extent that I can. For the time they have left. Which is? How much time do they have left, then? The curse has taken them. All of them. As it does every bearer forced to use their gift. Okay. With each draw on the ether, their bodies petrify. Till ah. all that remains is stone and pain, and so they are cast aside. Okay. There is nothing either I Martha see. or I can do to change I hope that. Hope we can do something but to change that. We can at least strive to make their final hours a little more bearable. <laughs> so why does Clive have that mark? So that mark is for bearers. Not have necessarily slaves, but sl the bears are again, treated and as slaves. Happiness denied you in this life. Thank you, Father. <laughs> yeah, nobody's having a good time here. Oh, fully petrified. Fuck me. I must offer you my own thanks for the medicine you so kindly brought. Ah, their final moments may be moments of peace. Yeah, morphine. I, I don't know if it's morphine. Well, 
When next you see Martha, pray tell her that two more have succumbed. It's not even it's not even a transmissible disease. It's just, hey, um, there are people who use up their own ether. I th I I'm guessing that's what's happening. Uh, so let's. Treat them the I, I think they're they're yes. probably magic users. We should. But why are some magic users okay and others not? Thank you for bringing us the physic. Would that we were not so reliant on Martha's kindness. But I fear we would have naught to soothe these bearers' woes without it. Save a prayer to a god that is not their own. Yeah. Uh, this sucks all round. There's nothing about this that does not suck. Why is this here? Weird. Just uh, looking around, see if I can find something. I can. Ten pinches of magic ash. Let's go back. Let's go deliver this to Martha then. Let me just um, double check something. Make sure you're aiming that at the fish there, son. Keep them nice and fresh. No, this. So. Can other people use magic, but... Or no, he's using a crystal. I don't understand. It was good, honest work building that. Yeah, let me see if I understand. A person with the power to cast magics without a crystal. Ah! There it is. So instead of using the crystal's ether, they use their own. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's messed up. Ah, you're back. Thanks for taking care of that. The abbot had a message for you. Two more have succumbed. I see. Come upstairs. So, now you know, eh? I've seen plenty of bearers die on the battlefield. But never like that. And all because they were born different. The powers that be can't take away their gift. So they strip them of their humanity instead. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's plenty who pity a bearer's plight. But so long as we're content to sit around, weeping for those on whose broken backs we're carried, we ain't gonna change nothing. And so you lend Sid your strength. What little of it I have. Used profits from this place to buy the poor buggers. So when the abbot told us the bearers were yours? Aye. They're my property. At least by law. Any still fit to work fetch a price beyond my means. All I can do is care for those who are past mending. But it's not all doom and gloom. Bernard's finished fixing that bridge for you. You can carry on to Eastpool now. You've got questions that need answering, ain't you? Well, I wish you luck. Thank you, Martha. Yep. Oh, I almost forgot. Sid and I have other friends in Rosaria. Wear this and they'll know you for one of us. Cool. Slumbering Chocobo. And know that you will always be welcome here. Th thank you, actually. That means a lot. You were right, Sid. It really is them. Lord Rosfield and Lady Warwick have come back to us. And long may they stay. Oh, that's really sweet. 
a little emotional. That's that's really really sweet. Nice. Hey, Sid. Sid. Oh, oh fuck. You're not where I left you. Hurt your hand. So did I. With a thousand little lightning bolts. Can't fling them around the way I used to. Can it... Can a dominant be a, be be a, a bearer? My decoration for long service and exemplary misconduct. Were you using a crystal before? But you didn't come here to compare war wounds. We didn't. No, do I have a full party now? For everything. <laughs> if you want to leave, that's your lookout. I'm sure you'll have a long and happy life together if you stay out of my way. Sid! <laughs> oh. I knew a girl back in the day. She was a slave to her fate, just like you. I wanted to save her. For a while, I even thought I could. But just because you think something doesn't make it true. Sid. I'm no saviour. Just a conceited old fool. I talk about people forging their own futures. But instead of handing them the hammer, I beat them with my own. Yeah. And if no bugger wants to listen to what you've got to say... You might as well keep your gob shut. But Clive, I will say this. Can I just take the power from you? You're not a monster. You're the same man you've always been. That's that's that, that's so kind. That's that's, that's extraordinarily kind. My fate. See it getting much easier. You might not be able to save anyone else, but at the very least, you can save yourself. <laughs> I'll try. And Jill. I'm sorry we didn't get a chance to talk, but I trust you'll take good care of the boy. Yes, I will. Is that the last of it? Aye. We'd best head back then. Wouldn't want to keep Nan waiting. So now then. Am I, am I gonna find Ambrosia at some point? I would like to. I would like to at least know the chocobos, okay? Oh, don't don't give me side quests now. I'm gonna have to do. I'm gonna have to do them. I have to find him. Can't talk now. I. Oh, you're Clive, aren't you? Yeah. Martha told me all about you. Word is you're a devil with that blade. Okay. You look like you're in a hurry. Where are you going? Not far, I hope. But I dare not waste a moment. It might cost a man his life. Sounds serious. What happened? Not so much what happened as what might. 
They've discovered he's a bearer, see? And now, one of his erstwhile friends and neighbors wants to see him clapped in chains. Where is this bearer? He wasn't fool enough to wait for the Imperials to arrive. Yeah. Poor Sod took to the road, left his whole life behind. But they'll be after him before long. And get him to safety, fast. Sure. Here. If you've the time and the inclination, I could do with a hand. Will you help me find him? Sure. Yeah, obviously. We bearers have to look out for each other. Thank you, Clive. With your help, we might catch up with him yet. His name's Norris. We need to find him and get him to Martha before the Imperials sniff him out. You found him yet? You won't catch a bastard standing around clucking like old ends. That fucking snake played me false. Acted like he was one of us and the old time. Um, I kind of just want to kill you. Imperials. Hanging's too good for him. Well, go on then. If he gets away, I'll see you fitted for a noose. All right, Ronald. We were just leaving. Look, this one's here to help. I was just filling him in. Ha! Send a bearer to catch a bearer, is it? Not bloody likely. That's it. I'll find the bastard myself. Come on now, Ron. It's dangerous out there. We wouldn't want you to come to any harm. You want something done right. You don't send a bearer. Clive, this might take a while. You start hunting our man, and I'll be along once I put Ronald's mind at ease. Someone said they saw Norris heading for the Fallen Gate. Maybe you could ask if anyone over that way knows anything. We have to find him. Don't let him slip through our grasp. Hmm. I'm not going to prioritize him. I better find this Norris right, before prioritize it. matters into his own hands. There is a hardly difficult to spot. What did he mean about being played false, I wonder? What do you need? Here, you're that bearer who works for Martha, aren't you? Can you give me a I hand? don't work for her, but Curse sure. my luck. I dropped my crystal off a cliff into the bloody swamp like an utter fool. Now, I've not got your knack, see, and I need that shard to chill my fish if I'm to take him to market. But it's just a short climb down. I'll make it worth your while. Yep. I can't promise anything. Well, just promise you'll look. Ah, there sure. may be one thing I failed to mention about the crystal. A creature might have already claimed it. Yeah, that was important. Claimed it. All right, eaten it, but 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 only might have, you understand. There were a lot of bog crabs down there. Nasty buggers, them. Right. <sighs> Sounds like I need to break a few shells. Oh, don't worry. There, there, there weren't too many of them. A veritable walk in the marsh, as they say. The ladders right over there. Sure. I'm not going to prioritize it. I'm just going to go do it. Oh, yeah, I can do that. Oh, awesome. Can I just jump down? Nope. There's no fall damage either, so... Perfect. Perfect. It's going to be one of thems. Never heard of crabs eating crystal. This should be interesting. It's over. Is it just me, or are these guys a lot tougher than the other ones? Did I, did I get it? I guess I did. Let's go up then. Okay. Hey, buddy. Well, any luck? Yours, I presume. Foul crystal. Great. Probably stinks. 
I, I don't. I don't think you can use. I don't think you can use it anymore. Or maybe you can. Any longer out in the sun, and my catch would have made for poor eating indeed. Interesting. Be more careful next time. I imagine oh, that de I will, I depending promise. on the mother crystal. No point casting my nets of a morning if I'm without a crystal to see the catch to town. Sure. It was a time honest taxpaying folk could get new ones whenever they wanted. Can't now, though, not for love nor money. Crystals are scarce, and the Empire tightens its purse strings more every day. Lose this little beauty again, and I might as well scrap my nets and take to begging. Sure. Sure. Let's keep going. You don't know a man called Norris, do you? I do, as it happens. He ran off that way not too long back. Looked like he was in a right all hurry. And he had a lantern with him for some reason. Never known him to lantern. set up after dark. He was making for the marshes then. All right. Thank you. Uh huh. You Let's go. That's one of our branded. You can't have gone far. Leave me alone. I better keep my eyes peeled. Oh, that house, right. There was a house here. A lantern. The one Norris was carrying, no doubt. At least I know which way he went. Someone made sure work of them. I wonder if that someone was Norris. Uh... A uh, short work of what? Uh, I mean, I killed a lot of people here. Norris, I presume. Leave me be. You're perfectly safe. We never branded. So that's how you stayed hidden. Ronald sent you after. I don't me, care. He? Set an imperial dog on his best friend. And when we were so close, I'll never forget the hatred in his eyes. But it doesn't matter now. I will not become a slave. As one bearer to another, please. Don't do this. You know how they treat our kind. Oh, they Ronald marked him because he do, me. can do magic without Ronald crystals. Martha's men did. He wanted to make sure you were safe. But he has the phoenix's blessing. How does that work? I don't understand. Ah, right. Martha takes him bearers. She's a friend. Right. You can trust That's her. why his mother... Believe me. Treat him like that, because... He was, he, he would, if not for his father, he would be considered a bear. She's a kind heart, kinder than most. Just wait here and stay out of sight. You'll be among friends soon enough. Thank you. There's few would have been so kind. And... Don't worry about it. Sorry. You're no imperial dog. Far from it. I've been called worse. Oh. I found a lantern back there. I assume it's yours. Thanks. I dropped it when those creatures attacked me. But, if I'm honest, I wasn't all that sorry to be rid of it. Ron gave it to me. All right. I'll keep hold of it. I might be able to use it to put an end to the Imperial Surge before it begins. Oh, nice. That is smart. Without a brand. To have lived free for so many years. I need to be betrayed by a friend. Yeah, this place sucks. This place straight up sucks. Oh, we fuck. There you are, Clive. How goes the search? Well branded. 
Have you found the bastard yet? I'm gonna fucking kill you. Only what was left of him. A corpse torn apart by monsters. And this. Let me see that. No. It can't be. Shall we consider that the end of the matter then? Or do you need to see a body? No, no. I, I mean, I've no use for bearer bones. He's dead. Let that be an end to it. You're, you're, those you're fucking it scum. Was, done what they were supposed to do and spotted him sooner. Letting a bearer go about without a brand? It's not right, I tell you. Who want anything to do with me now, eh? There goes the bearer lover, they'll say. I'll be a laughing stock. Yeah, you will, but not for that reason. Is it true, Clive? Is Norris really... He's alive. You'll find him in a hut in the marshes. He's expecting you. Oh, you crafty. Still, you did the right thing. Thank you. It's not much considering, but please, take this. I'll take it. Take all you, all you can give me.